Okay, here we are. This is Angela Arnold again, and I'm showing you how to use Weebly.com. I'm on my new page, which is right here on the navigation bar, and I want to link to the hidden page that I just created. Okay, so I can use any photograph or I can use any text to link. And let's say I'm going to click here. I'm going to highlight this text because when I want somebody to click on this, we'll go to the new page two that I just created. And I'm going to click on the link bar. Okay, when I click on the link, the pages that I have set up will display. And I want it to link to new page two. So I will click save and it's just that simple. Uh, when I publish this website, if I were to publish it, it would link to the page. And you can tell that because you can see it's a little bit of a hyperlink there. Once the page is published, I will be able to click on that link and it will take me directly to new page two. There's nothing really more to it than that. It's not anything secret. If I had a photograph here, let's pull down a photograph. Okay. Let's presume that I'm going to upload my image again. Okay. I'm going to upload South Africa, Morocco right there. All right. I've up uploaded this image. And guess what I want to do? I want to link this someplace. So I'll go up to the bar. I'll say set the link. And again, it's going to tell me, will be linked to a full-size version of this or no? I can link it to a bigger image of this, but I want to link it to one of my web pages. And I'm going to link it to new page two. And I'll just click save. And that's really that simple. That's all you have to do to link to something else. Now, if you decide, let's click this again. Let's decide I want to link to an outside website. I just click this bar and I enter in the URL of where I want it to link. And I, let's say I want to link it to, um, these students are studying abroad and they want to take some uh, SAT tests and AP tests while they're overseas. So I want to link to collegeboard.com and get some information there. Okay, I don't have to um, put in the www it does that for me and when I link to an outside page I always want to open a link in a new window because I don't want the person to lose my website because they go to another page so I'm going to say link to that page and that's live as soon as I publish it this will link when somebody clicks here it will link to collegeboard.com so that's how you can link a photograph you can link text um, and you can set the links and start all over again. You can link to emails and send files and things like that. So um, the link setting is very, very useful because all of your pages, you want to be able to link to other pages on your website or you want to be able to link to outside web pages. And that's it for us right now. I have just a couple more things that I'd like to show you during these Weebly tutorials, and I'll be checking in with you again soon. Take care.